Those people are not college material. Moon Pie, I know you don't like to hear this, but there are some things in life that can only be learned in time. So you must have learned them all, huh? Get out of my house. Hang in there. I'm hanging. Hey, this is be quite a story to tell your grandkids, huh? I live alone, I'm single. I don't think grandkids are in the picture. Oh, well, I, I got a wife, kids. It, it's overrated. And then my mother said I wasn't mature enough for college. Can you believe that? Absolutely. So you're on their side too? I'm Vietnamese. In my culture, until your parents die, you're basically a baby. Really? My grandmother still treats my dad like a child. At dinner, he can't sit until she sits, and he can't speak until he's spoken to. Well, I'm glad I'm not Vietnamese. It's not as fun as I make it look. Well, you can't bring her home to an empty apartment. Bring her here and we'll look after her until she's back on her feet. You sure? Of course. We'll set her up in Georgie's room. Thanks, Mayor. See you in a bit. Hey, George. It's real nice of you taking care of her like this. Yeah, it was kind of my fault. Kinda. It was all your fault. Bye. Hey. Hey, how do we do? You didn't miss anything. That bad. I can safely say you saw the best hit of the night. <sighs> How's she doing? Yeah, not bad. Could be worse. Little whiplash, couple of bruised ribs, broken arm, and collarbone. But that's it. Pretty funny how you jumped out of the way and let her get clobbered. I did not jump out of the wood. Oh yeah, you did. <laughs> they got you on tape. Okay, fine. But that was pure instinct. Besides, she shouldn't have been standing on the sideline. Why was she there? I told her she could. Oh man, you must feel terrible. Of course I do. I mean, it's all on you. You done? Oh baby, I'm just getting started. Oh, you poor dear. Come on in. Thanks. I hope I'm not putting you out. Of course not. Oh. Hey, Sheldon. Can you believe my mother said I can't go to college? So you just put her in my room without consulting me? Consulting you? Who cares what you think? Well, I ain't gonna sleep on the couch. It's just for a few nights until she can take care of herself. Can I at least stay at Meemaw's? If you promise not to come back. Why you gotta be so mean to me? Just feels right. And then after Dr. Sturgis incorporated my math, he refused to give me a co-author credit. Sheldon, she doesn't want to hear about that. It's okay. So when your bones broke, did you hear a crunch? No. Did my dad have to give you mouth to mouth? No. I don't know how my mom kisses him. 